Hello friends, how are you? Welcome to USN Mix channel. Today's topic is Notepad tricks. So today we will discuss about Microsoft Notepad. So today, we'll, uh, today I will show you one interesting tips of Microsoft Notepad. See, there is one icon, one program file in my desktop. Name is one. When I click once in this file, multiple pages will open. Suppose, see, Excel is open calculator is open and see this is the chrome browser is also open so how can you create this it is need sometime it is need that on the next day if you want to open important files important documents in what in your uh, for your office purpose or any for or anything for your learning purpose you just create it in this in this way and uh, you can save it in your microsoft desktop so in the morning in in one click you just get all the files at once so how can you create this so today i will show you so this is the very interesting so friends today i will show you these tricks of microsoft notepad but before start i want to say if you are new in our channel then subscribe to our channel science and technology related topics will discuss in this channel if you like our video and like our channel then don't forget to like share subscribe and make comments and also click on the bell button on the right side if you click on the bell button you will get notification for the next videos to get full information please watch the video from the beginning to the end otherwise you will not get the full information and miss many useful information on this topic okay friends let's start let's so let's know how can you create this type of program file so that you can create you just click once and multiple windows multiple important documents will open in front of you so how can you create I just remove this from my computer. I just delete it, and now everyone knows how can you get this notepad from there. From the start button, you just click on this, and on the you just open notepad. First, you just open notepad, and you just write at rate echo e c h o echo space of then enter then start spelling is right so otherwise h r o m e chrome dot e x c enter and in this way you just open multiple windows or whatever the spelling and the extension path is should be right otherwise it will not open suppose you want to open chrome browser and my mozilla firefox firefox dot exc or you want start c a l c and you just exit S spelling is a spelling should be right otherwise the program does not work so just f save it where you save this the icon i just make it name i just make this name is uh, new N not new you just give the extension dot b a t bat file so you just i just make the new name new dot bat bat whatever you make changes you just create you just create any name you do any you select any name but you just do the dot d bat before uh whenever you just save this name dot bat is the program file so save it and now this is the new file you have seen and just click once click and see the calculator is open and chrome browser is open and this is the firefox mozilla firefox is open in the and as many time as you click left click on this program file then all the time this program is open in front of you so in this way you just click once and multiple programs will open so in this short process you can create this for your emergency purpose and this is very helpful to remember all the remember your work whatever you need to tomorrow so you can make this document create this document otherwise you don't know and again you if you need anything 
else to edit then you can just right click on it and this edit section you just make changes in it suppose you just want to excel file excel type it and save then it is created now you just save it and it's done so now click on on, on it so this is the excel file uh, microsoft mozilla firefox then this is the excel and this is the calculator and this is the chrome see as many times as you just click on once click and all the files are open now in this way you can create multiple open multiple files in front of you but now if you want but now if you want a particular file to open in your front in front of you then how can you do so again you just go to the notepad and create at the same way you just write it at rate echo echo space of then enter then enter start space double inverted comma then invert and get inverted comma suppose I just want to open this office file then I just open this type of file this PDF so first just just select this and copy this the path and then paste it so D in this D drive in the office you just and then you just the file is and the way the path of this file so in D drive then office and then you just rename it and copy this and paste but what is the extension of this file so in properties you just say dot pdf so dot pdf and you just close this important and you can also in this way you can select many files but i just show you in once one file and now exit and save it so now you just name so important so you just make the name important and you know whatever I say before I say that you just select the name and after that after the name you just put dot b a t dot b a t file and save it so then it is saved as important see this is bad so directly the file is open this is amazing feature of this notepad so you can use it of any if this is very helpful and you can if you want to add more files then you can just edit and you make sure that you can make start from start and again and again in this way you just created another file and in the same way you can add more files and in one click multiple files will open so I just show you for one and another way another way to create to create this type of bat file to open multiple documents and uh, so I but I if I show you again and again then it will be strong so I this time the video will be longer so I make this file in the first so that you have seen at rate echo space of then space semicolon then semicolon then space run program then start cal start excel then dot 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 open files then start office suppose i if i need this office so, so in the d drive see this is the file i just show you where i want to know audit and audit reply so i just show you audit in the audit file there is a one word document audit reply you have seen that i have written here audit reply dot docx docs again if you want to more file for the 
I make this file before because to in the same way so if you no need to type again and again and otherwise the video will be more longer for your information I just show you that if you want to add more files suppose you want to the this kitchen set status or reply LA or any files you just add this so no this not this file suppose I just want uh, YPC and this file so you just select this copy then paste then backslash and then the file name what is the file name rename it and copy copy and uh, paste and now see the extension see extension excel sx dot excel sx dot xl sx and now the close the inverted comma now save it now just close and important click on this no no this is the file and this is the file I already make and see if the file is only saved in this name in this way file this is saved in notepad format but when you just save it suppose I just want to save it save as desktop doc2 suppose I make this name doc2 dot bat is must to make this type of program file so dot bat don't forget to dot bat file so every time when you create this you make this file must must name it any name and after that you just add this extension dot bat 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 is the this is make this program file so this is doc2 and click on it see this is the microsoft excel file is open whatever i just put it and another is this is the word file whatever i need so in the okay friends that's it and after watching this video now you can know the detail about notepad trips and microsoft excel notepad tricks hope you'll enjoy this video and like this video thanks for watching this video if you like our video and our channel then you can like share subscribe of our yourself mix youtube channel and if you have any information regarding this video or want to ask more then you can make comments in the comment section on this video of yourself mix youtube channel thanks for watching this video once again thank you